prepared to, to choose between this job and this job, which one are you going to choose? No, I know naturally we are all going to choose this, right? May I ask why? Probably because this is a higher paying job, right? Okay, let me show you. Do you know that among these two jobs, this is actually the worst job here? How so? Okay, let's compare the nature of those jobs. This here offers $1,200 monthly. This $10,000 monthly. Now, this is the nature of the job with the lesser wage. It is a freelancing job. You can work four times a week and you have time now working days. You work from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. or more depending on the required time to finish the job. Or you start working at the time of your choice. Then you deliver the job before 7 p.m. You have a supportive boss and supportive co-workers. And you also have assurance of your security. You have peace of mind and you can work on the go. This means you can work anywhere you are. Now, this is the nature of the job with the wage $10,000 monthly. It's an on-site job. Basically, this means that your physical presence is needed. You work six times in a week and sometimes you carry the work over to the seventh day if you can't finish on the sixth day. You work from 7 a.m. to 4 p.m. as is written on your offer letter that you end up leaving the office every day around 6 p.m. or 7 p.m. or even more in the evening. The environment is very toxic. You have unhealthy, competitive co-workers and you very, you very, very demeaning bosses. Your mental, you suffer from mental stress, physical stress, emotional stress, you have no peace of mind, you have no assurance of your security, which means that any day your bosses wake up and they decide that you have to go and they let you go. You hardly get any free working day. You must be physically present like I said before. You suffer from anxiety due to high expectations from your bosses and your co-workers. So now, looking closely at these two jobs, are you still going for the one of the $10,000 a month? <laughs> I'm sure by now your answer has changed. But truth be told, this is what the majority of us face daily in life because we sort of have high paying jobs. Why abandoning the low paying jobs that gives us peace of mind? Which that place is like this. Most people never see the trap they are in. They work very hard for little money, clinging to the illusion of job security and looking forward to a three-week vacation each year and maybe a simple pension after 45 years of service. This is a total description of life and reality of some of us that have been enslaved by our jobs thinking that one day we will miraculously become rich. Then, when the riches are not forthcoming, you end up angry as a villain at everything, forgetting that with the nature of your job, you neither have the time nor the energy to achieve any of your goals. Because that's how it is. It's a job that enslaves you. You work from six to seven. However, if you have a looping job that offers you time, security, and energy, you will more likely end up achieving your goals because you have the time and energy. So guys, I want us to be very careful as we hunt for job these days. Consider everything before you accept that offer letter. Because some jobs we do are the real causes of our failures in life. Before I go, I am going to leave you with one business success story. I know by now some of us already know the story, right? But I'm still going to tell us. In 1919, Walt Disney was fired from the Kansas City Star because according to his editor, he lacked imagination and he had no good ideas. Just imagine Walt Disney. But three years later, he founded his first professional film studio before he eventually became super successful years later. I want you to know that sometimes having little means having a lot. So guys, this is for it for this video. I know that by the time you can click this video, you are hoping to hear that, okay, this this is the high paying job that you should be seeking this year. Oh, this is not a clickbait video. 
This is to tell us the real truth, the real truth behind all these high paying jobs. If nobody is telling you, I'm telling you now, be careful. Because this is how some of us will end up tomorrow, regretting and wishing they didn't take that decision. They didn't make that choice of accepting that offer letter. And what you do, there is one there is one spirit that goes with this kind of job. You are always you are always afraid of leaving the job, even though you are elite, you are afraid of leaving because you think that once you leave it, you will not have any way of surviving, no means of life livelihood. So you end up being enslaved. Before you know it, old age has come. Time for retirement, and you start asking yourself, What did I get myself into? I thought I had this big dream for myself. I thought I wanted to see the world. I thought I wanted to be financially free. How am I in this situation? Then you end up hoping on your children for them to be the one to live that dream you wanted for yourself. So guys, just be careful out there. Be careful. Because sometimes our grief and fear of what we do in the future are the reason of our failures. Once again, be careful guys. So guys, this is it guys. Please share this video with your friends and friends alike. Also, don't forget to like, share your thoughts with us in the comment section below because we like to know what you think. Until next time, bye again.